Welcome to Loch Lomond. We start this week's vlog at the Bonnie Banks of Loch Lomond. Yeah, we stayed here last night. Uh, we stayed in Ballock, which is a small town on the southern shore of Loch Lomond. Mm -hmm. So we've just come here to Loch Lomond Shores, just to have a little look yeah. round. It's a bit of a sort of like a outlet shopping centre. Shopping it's not centre, that yeah. great, but there is a wicked, or what looks to be a wicked yeah, restaurant, a yet. Jurassic Grill dinosaur restaurant. It's not open yet. <laughs> But that's a shame. Yeah, we, I think that you would have been, been tempted. Yeah, I would have been very yeah, tempted. Yeah, we'd have gone in there, but yeah, never mind. Yeah. So yeah, we're just gonna have a little look around here, and then we're gonna be moving on further north up the the side of the lock. Where we're and staying stay in the night. Just again on the banks of Loch Lomond. We stayed last night for free, and hopefully tonight will also be free. Uh, but it's getting cold. We keep saying it in the vlogs, it's getting cold. It is. There's a chill today. There's there a is chill. That the chill. hats and scarves are gonna be coming out soon. Very soon. Here are some cool facts about Loch Lomond. Did you know this is the largest body of water in the UK? One of the islands is home to wallabies. It is 23 miles long and 153 meters deep. <laughs> Hello, we is home back to the car park. And Just hold it still. And we is start to go to a new one. Then we're going to find out what's next. Now we're back. Welcome home. This has never been home. <laughs> I know. It's lovely, isn't it? It's beautiful. There we go, look at deer. Yeah, we'll get warm. Yeah, it's going to be cold out. And it's going to be a cold night as well tonight. Maybe Travelled a bit further north and we've arrived at Glencoe Mountain Resort. Um, you can pay for the electric pitches here, it's £20 a night, but we don't need electric, so we're going for the £5 a night pitch, which is just on the gravel, but we are literally just surrounded by mountains here. And over there, you might, well, I don't think you can see it from here, can you, babe? Can you see the, the tubing? No, you can't from here. No, so over there is obviously the, the ski lift and the ski and stuff, but they've also got tubing, which looks like pretty good fun so we're gonna go and do that the boys are well up for it me and Pip are feeling a little bit nervous but I'm sure we'll be fine it's not that big so we'll give it a go ready oh this is nerve-wracking You ready, Pip? Yeah. Let's go. What's your 
type So now I wanna know all about you Deep connection Lights a spark How was it, Jack? Oh. So good. Yeah. Refreshing rain. Refreshing rain? Oh, that's one way of calling it. Don't forget your hats. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cheers, pal. Go grab your hats. Yeah, thank you very much. Real fun. Did you enjoy yourself? And what were your words, you Piper? Yourself? What did you just how did you describe tubing? Epic. 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 Absolutely epic. Jack was well into it, weren't you, Jack? Yeah. You were going fast. Start, but I wasn't totally scared to do it. So you were scared to start with? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I was a little bit too. But you did it. And I, I did. did. I did it and it wasn't too bad. Was it was like, quite I fun. Pick the stuff up and go again, go again, go, go again. 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 Oh, you like this place? Yeah. Yeah. So, if you had to recommend it to others, what would you say? Would you say you have to come here and have some fun, or would you say it's rubbish? Good. It's good. Well, it's another rainy, windy day today. Might not seem like it there, but now it possibly does. But I uh, thought to show you our park up. So we parked here at the Glencoe Mountain Resort. Uh, very good place. They've got chairlift up to the top. Even in the summer, you can go up there. Uh, in the winter, you can obviously do your, your skiing, snowboarding. Um, they've also got mountain biking, tubing, all that sort of stuff. They've got a nice cafe bar open till eight o'clock. So me and Jack went up there and had a pint. Obviously, I had a pint. Jack didn't. Um, They've got four proper camping pitches where they charge you £20 a night uh, with all the services, etc. Or they don't advertise it. In fact, they've got a sign on the entrance saying no parking overnight. But if you do ask, there's a little donation box and they say, look, just park out the way. So we're on this real sort of gravel bit right in the corner. Um, the view is absolutely incredible. Look at that. Uh, yeah, very rainy. But uh, the view's good. Um, and we would very much recommend it. So the Glencoe Mountain Resort, the tubing in the summer for the kids is fantastic. And I'm sure the winter sports are good as well. But I've never do, never done winter sports. Not really into that, should probably try it. But And there we go. So there we are, Glencoe Mountain Resort. It's on the, the apps and stuff like that. So you'll be able to check it out. And today we're going to be heading down to Glencoe Village itself, which I think is only about 20 minutes away. Um, and there's a few viewpoints on the way we're going to stop off at even though the cloud at the minute is pretty low so we might not get much of a view so there we go I can see us breaking down the barrier oh yeah with the speed of light we cross the stratosphere oh yeah oh that's a you Right, so this is our final stop of our, well, this part of our Scotland tour. We have come today to Glen Nevis, which is home to Ben Nevis. Home to Ben Nevis and a load of other mountains and we can't tell the difference between any of them. Yeah, as we were driving down, we were sort of looking around us at the different mountains and just trying to trying to figure out which one was Ben. Well, I think I saw one with snow on the top, but then Kira told me it's not snow, yeah, it's you just rocks. You, you can't trust Richard with anything to do with colour. He's a little bit colour blind. Well, he'll so, say he's so not. Kira says. He'll say he's not. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, I really I want to know what you think of my nice blue coat. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're down, we're just near Fort William, just down Glen Nevis. Uh, we've just parked at the Lower Falls uh, car park, which uh, there's a little waterfall there, which is yeah, nice. Yeah, really nice. We're just having a nice walk uh, down the river, which is lovely. But uh, yeah, we're going to just try and find somewhere to park up for the night. And yeah, There's no over park night parking like here, is there? It's sort of not allowed, not permitted for free anyway, no wild parking sort of spot. No, there's a campsite further down the road and there's also a small farm which you can pay 10 quid to stay the night there with no facilities so I'm but, being cheapskates I'd rather just pay nothing yeah we're gonna th apparently there's a little very glamorous yeah. that you can stay at so um we're gonna head there and try our luck maybe because we like a free park up absolutely um, and next week guys we are going to be heading to the Isle of Skye which Whoa. we are mega looking forward to because it looks absolutely stunning yeah um, and the weather looks stunning as well and we've only got rain every day <laughs> yeah 40 mile an hour winds 
Beautiful. Well, yeah, it's going to be interesting, but it should be good, guys. So join us next week. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Absolutely. Please yeah. do like and subscribe. It, it Leave supports us a our channel and yeah, helps us to grow. So we really do appreciate it, guys. So, yeah, see you next week. See you next week.